Hello. I'm uh, just making a little scene, you know, for Christmas. And uh, one of the problems we always come across is hair. Whether you're importing from Daz or importing from iClone, you always get these problems. So what I want to show you is in the, this is called Big Help by this character. And uh, oh, wrong one. Okay, so in her character, if I go to just the actual file itself of her, it's very easy to fix all the characters. And the roll down on the left here, you can highlight it. You'll see that it's the hair. These four ones here. There might be two, four, or six, but that's the hair. Now, what's kind of easier is if we use, you know, like even moving it over here so that you can watch the person as you're doing it. And uh, just go down to your opacity, because that's all that's missing, and darken it up a little bit. And then just make it whatever you feel is suiting your character. Um, that one. And then we can go up to the second one. Alright, so again, do opacity. Um, capacity. I thought about that. When you get that sort of shade, that sort of usually looks pretty good. Let me just double check. Yep, looks good. And you can make it suit whatever darkness or thickness you want to get in relation to how close. Now there's one more down here. And I'll just bring that one back up. And opacity. Okay, so bring that down. Now you can see pardon me, all the hair is pretty good. Kind of all over the body. And uh, whether like I say, that's how easy it is to fix the hair when you import it into Unreal. Save it. And your uh, character will be what you want it to be. Alright, thank you. Hope that helps.